Today we're in Little Falls, New Jersey, and we're gonna be checking out the town. Hope you'll join me. I'm in the Peckman Preserve, which is where the Peckman River flows through in Little Falls, New Jersey. The Peckman River is a tributary of the Passaic River. You can see all the trees here. I'm sure it's beautiful in the summer, but we're not in the summer right now, so we have to deal with the winter views. All right, we found the Peckman River. You see it flowing. I'm always scared to drop my camera in the water. Here we have the Little Falls Municipal Building. You see the clock. It's a pretty nice building. Pretty elaborate. It says Little Falls at the top. Wow. Quite interesting, quite interesting. We're passing United Methodist Church at Little Falls. And it's a quite interesting architecture. You know, I have no clue. I wish I knew more about architecture so I could explain it. What influence it took from. But I know nothing about architecture, so. Here we have the Morris Canal, which was an important trading and transportation hub through the Delaware and Hudson Rivers. Wow, so the Morris Canal was built in 1826 and it was facilitating trade through the Hudson and the Delaware River and it was in operation for about a century until 1925 when the railroad, the expansion of the railroad deemed it useless. You know, before the railroad, most trade and transportation was done through boats and rivers and oceans, but once the railroad, once the railroad was formed, the Morris Canal became obsolete. We're in the Morris Canal Preserve. You see, here's a gazebo in the Morris Canal. Wow. All right, let's go find an interesting spot. Wow, you can see. This canal was built, man-made. It didn't, you know, people think of the Panama Canal and how it was a huge uh, invention that really saved time, so much time throughout world history now, where rather than going all the way around South America, they could just go straight through the Panama Canal. And something like the Morris Canal in Little Falls is interesting because there were also canals built around here. Essentially, it was built 200 years ago. A man-made canal through Little Falls, New Jersey. We're coming upon some waterfalls. Is this a good fishing spot? I don't know. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> wow, you see the waterfall. You see the canal comes through there. Wow. Very cool. Very cool. The Morris Canal. You know, there's a lot of rocks. It's not easy to walk through this place. 
let's get back onto Main Street after exploring the Morris Canal. We found the Main Street in Little Falls. You know, this is quite a congested town. Maybe it's just because it's like 3 p.m. people are getting out of school and everyone's driving, but it seems like a very congested town. People are, there's so many cars on Main Street. Wow. You see it says Home of the Yogi Berra Museum because parts of Montclair State University are in Little Falls where the U Yogi Berra Museum is. Unfortunately, a couple of years ago it was broken into. People stole some very important Yogi Bear artifacts. I think I think they stole his World Series rings. It's pretty messed up. So here we have it looks like a veterans park right in the center of Little Falls. You can see all the memorials. Here's a World War II memorial. Here we have a September 11th memorial. And uh, they have it covered right now. I wish I could see it, but they have a covering on it. Maybe they, they put it on in the winter. Over here, we have the Little Falls Fire Department. Well, it's a very cool park in Little Falls. All right, guys, that's gonna be it from Little Falls, New Jersey. Hope you enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching.